The countdown is on. The Great American Eclipse is just 34 days away. Today, Arkansas State officials announced what they're doing to get ready. Aaron Castleberry has more. The countdown is literally on. Arkansas Governor Sarah Huckabee Sanders, along with cabinet secretaries and directors, discussed their preparations ahead of the Great American Eclipse, which will happen on Monday, April the 8th. Next month's eclipse has the potential to be one of the largest tourism events in our state history. Arkansas Department of Transportation Director Lori Tudor says RDOT has worked on their plans for two years. We know there's going to be delays. Because of that, the state is issuing a construction holiday. There will be no lane closures or active work zones from Friday, April 5th until Tuesday the 9th. Tudor also said RDOT is working with the Arkansas Trucking Association to limit oversized and overweight lows. Park Heritage and Tourism Secretary Shay Lewis said that there are events planned at all state parks that are in totality. Each state park that's within totality is offering specific programs, tours and activities uh, in and around the before and after the eclipse itself. Education Secretary Jacob Oliva said while this is a fantastic tourism event for the state, it is also an educational opportunity, including having school-age students collect light data for the University of Central Arkansas. In fact, we have 60 schools that our students are being trained on how to use the digital devices to capture this data and will participate in about 45 counties as the eclipse goes through the whole state. The governor emphasized that this event will be a big one for the state and hopes it will keep visitors coming back to Arkansas after the eclipse. Many people will be coming to our state for the first time, and we want to make sure they keep coming back time and time again. For more on the state's eclipse planning or to see any of our stories on the eclipse, just go to KAITA.com and click on the Eclipse tab.